how I wear it to the gym and whatnot. And so I thought that I would include a hair portion into this video as well. This hair was sent to me by Sunbird Hair Co. It is both an Amazon and a whole lot to this hair, you guys. Like, I bleached it using like 30 volume developer. Like, it took me a minute to create this unit. Like, it was like a two week process, not even gonna lie. And I thought about filming it, but like, when I'd started and like things just were not going the way that I wanted to, I was like, mm, maybe I should not. Maybe I should I, you know? And so I just decided not to, but I did start off by filming the process. So maybe I'll insert a little clip here, just because I'm literally just curling my hair. So you guys can kind of see like how I began this process. Um, I think. The mistake that I had made honestly wasn't even like with the bleaching because I lifted it properly and everything but it was just like the combination of dyes that I had to use. I'd use like a blue black and then I used blue. A lot more of like the blue black dye deposited onto my hair instead of just like the blue dye and so that was my mistake. Like next time I know I'm gonna have to not use the blue black. I was just trying to play it safe y'all. I didn't want my hair to be like too blue and so yeah, that's what I did. Um, I'm gonna like zhuzh out these curls in a second. I just kind of want them to stay in place for now. But I have a 16 inch hair. I feel as though it really held up and maintained its like hair texture despite me putting it through the absolute most. Bleaching from like level 1B and up is like really damaging on hair. And so I was kind of shocked to see that it held up as well as it did because y'all it was not looking so hot when it was like super super blonde like it looked frail I was like thinking maybe I shouldn't have done this like I feel like I might have like messed up the hair but y'all the hair is holding up fine as you can tell like it is not like it doesn't look the way that I thought it was going to when I was in mid process <sighs> So really happy with the results. I'm gonna go through and just add some like random curling mousse. So every time I bleach the knots on a frontal or closure, I always will have problems with the um, shedding of the closure there on after. Just cause it makes it a lot like more fragile. And so I get it. But I even tried using like a knot sealant this time around too. This is the finished look here. I will leave all links to the